Well, Louisiana is close to losing one of its natural inhabitants. The alligator snapping turtle has the greatest conservation need since 2012. Mia Hudgens reports how it may become an endangered species. Within the next year, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service will make a decision on if the alligator snapping turtle should be listed under the Endangered Species Act. They aren't quite listing them as threatened or endangered, but there, there are people who have noticed that their populations are declining. The LDWS restoration program harvests the eggs and let the babies mature before releasing them into the wild. This is a safe way to make sure the population will increase in its natural habitat. Louisiana is a fabric, and every time you lose something, an animal, a bird, even an insect, it's like pulling a thread out of that fabric. A female alligator snapping turtle can lay up to 40 eggs. However, 80% will die because of predators. The remaining babies still have a high death rate, but predators aren't the reason. Something that's a threat um, in a lot of their places is the prop of a boat or, the, um, or a car. Luckily, the Louisiana Purchase Gardens and Zoo has been a helping hand in saving those turtles who have been hurt. We'll still be able to have them and display them. We're actually part of the solution. The restoration program in the zoo can't do this alone. They need the love from the community. What people have to do is people just have to care. They have to decide that this animal is worth keeping in the state of Louisiana. In addition, slow down while driving a boat or a car in areas they live. This not only saves just one snapping turtle, but ultimately the whole species.